those sound effects are still so loud. That's better. At least it's not like those clicks of all the menu presses are so loud in my ears. And it looks like they're loud on the mixer board too. Ah, travel to destination. Armadillo. Oh, you can jump off your horse? How have I never done that before? wonder what we're going to have to do for Irish. I can't remember. I can't remember. Hey, why is this wide open? I don't think I've ever seen this wide open. I heard someone talking about me. Irish is, is in the saloon. He's back here somewhere. Hello. 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 Oh, yes, boy. Oh, you messed up properly this time, didn't you? You little paddy bastard. You thieving Mick Cunt. You got it all wrong, Welsh. All wrong. It was French, I promise. He said he was going to rip you off. Now he's ripping me off. Yeah, keep on talking there, Irish. In about 15 more seconds, your whole world's gonna turn black! <laughs> What's up, boys? <sighs> Fuck off, boy. This don't concern you. Uh, I think it does. When a man with a sing-song voice tells me to fuck off, it always concerns me, boyo. Huh? Look here. This patty bastard stole our guns. Tried to steal our horses. Lost clear on the matter. I never stole nothing, sir. Never did. Not in all my life. That French cunt is playing with the Welshman's tiny and ineffective mind. Push your mind. <laughs> anyway, you all got horses now. No one needs to die. Leave them be. Who do you think you are, boy? -o? The bloody cavalry? Kind of. Your voice is really starting to get on my nerves, boy. -o. And you're getting on my nerves. Yeah. Oh shit, I shot his hat off. Well, Mr. Nigel West Dickens said you'd help me locate a machine gun. And since I just saved your life... Oh, I can't thank you enough for taking care of those two degenerates. Uh, untrustworthy, Hi. poor in personal hygiene, lacking in the finer qualities of a, a gentleman. <laughs> uh. What about the gun? It'd be my pleasure. Uh, she's magnificent government issue. It'll be a bit of a ride, but we'll get there soon enough. Uh, follow me, fella. Let's go. Let me loot these bodies first, though. Alrighty, my guardian angel, this way. Hello. I need them pistol ammos. Uh, Ooh, and seven bucks. Up, fella. Come on then, let's find this guy. What's your name, friend? John. John Marston. Stroke of luck you came along, fella. I thought I'd drunk me last breakfast there for a second. <laughs> Who were those five specimens of humanity? They was me only friends in the world. And boy, am I glad to see them bastards dead. We all met on the boat over a few years back, we did. Kick his thieves ever since, and that right there was the problem. Is it normal for friends in Europe to drown each other? Never trust a Welshman, me pa always told me. And he got his throat slit, so he should know. The kind of fellow who <laughs> for from a blind sow, and then kick her for squealing. And as for that French bastard... He didn't sound very French. Not for now. 
The thieving bastards are holed up at the cabin by the lake. Can't wait to see the look on their faces when we blast in there. They'll be more surprised than a slut dog with their first porcupine. You best not be lying to me. Listen, fella, I didn't ask for your help back there. I don't owe you nothing. I'll decide what you do and don't owe me. I've had enough of your overly aggressive manners, fella. You don't know who you're dealing with here. Irish, I've met enough men like you to last me a lifetime. Make quick work of those fellas if they give you trouble. The gun's stored oh, just inside that fun. What about you helping me out? Uh, I'll cover you from the ridge. I'm better from long range. It'll be a piece of cake, fella. Trust me. Shoot your hat, I'm sorry. Man, you got shot real good. Oh man, I got shot real good. Taking your shit, taking your shit, cause you're dead and you won't need it anymore. Sweet cabin. Look at these dicks. Duster coat menu entry. And what? Oh, there's a new treasure hunter thing. Search silent steed instead. Complete California Stranger's Task. Make a private playing blackjack at last scout of fork. Claim a treasure hunter bounty alive. Treasure hunter bounty. Complete gap tooth breach hideout. Purchase at the tailor in Thieves Landing. Search Thieves Landing. Claim a baller twins gang bounty alive. Defend residents of Hannigan's stead. Obtain rank 10 in all ambient challenges. Oh, that's the legend one. Oh, the duster coat is just unlocked. Nice. You can now wear the duster outfit. Well, howdy. Horsey. Come here, horsey. Where's this Irish bastard? So I don't get lost. Oh, is that fucking Benedict Point? Really? Come on, a bitch. Come on.
train. train is going for where I'm going. Because it might not. Can't take anything from the train? Oh shit, oh shit! <laughs> well, okay. Let's not talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, oh hi, horse. Hi, horse. Look at my horse, it is amazing. Damn it, the train was going where I wanted to go. Son of a biscuit. I wonder if I can jump on it from the back. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh man, Irish is in bad shape. Man is born unto trouble. Get away from me! Right here! Where's that machine gun, Irish? Oh, Mr. Marston! Oh, boy. I, I found you one. Uh. Found us one, Irish. We're in this together. You, me, and an assault on Fort Mercer. I'm the guy that saved you from getting killed back there, and who you owe your life to, remember? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Happens to me all the time. <laughs> you don't want it to happen to you again, do you, Irish? Uh, no, friend. I wants to buy you a drink. I, I wants to tell you how much she means to me, how special she is. And I want to tell you that if you don't produce a Gatling gun within the hour, you'll wish you'd been killed back there. <laughs> it's the whiskey, sir. That's fair. <laughs> Uh, it gives me the memory of a newborn babe, as innocent as can be. Uh, and it makes me violently angry. <laughs> Shall we go look for that gun, sir? Yes. Let's do that. 
Come on, then. We'll find your precious gun. Stop, damn it! All right, Irish, don't fuck with me this time. The lily of the west. You're not gonna pass out on me, are you, Irish? <laughs> me? No, I'm right, this raid. <laughs> or at least somewhere stuck between hair and men. Well, you're gonna be stuck somewhere between dying and dead if you try to cross me again. It's words like that at all, feller. The intentions were pure. I swear it on me, poor mother's life. I just get a tad confused from time to time. Honest mistake. If there's any more confusion, I'll finish what your friends in Armadillo start. Jesus! You're an impatient bastard, aren't you? Where's the gun, Irish? I hear some miners been blabbing about a machine gun they found. Apparently, they got it stashed up in Gap Tooth Breach. What do miners want with a machine gun? Shoot it at somebody, I suppose? Or sell it? I don't know. I've never been down a mine in all my life. Sounds real fishy to me, Irish. I've just about had it with you and your game. You and Wes Dickens are so crooked, you can swallow nails and spit out corkscrew. Maybe if you was more cordial with folks, they might be better inclined to help you. <laughs> I saved your life and you repaid me by lying, nearly getting me killed. Not fair now, Johnny. We should go around the side of Gap Tooth so the miners don't see us coming. I still don't know what miners would want with a machine gun. Miners are always fighty bastards. You spend too long without daylight and foxes, and it starts playing with your mind. I never heard so much shit come out of one mouth. Only telling you what I heard. Oh, and we'll need a wagon or something to get it out of there. That gun's heavier than sin. So how was I supposed to move it by myself last time? Two-faced little bastard. Easy there. Here we are. Let's stop here a moment to get a lie of the land. Nobody's nice to me. Everyone's trying to backstab me. Just trying to help. Rid the western countryside of a the foul is beast. The sea, and there's a shaft them bastards used to haul out heavy ore. We, I mean you, can use that lift to get you and the gun to the surface. I do it all myself, but the mines play havoc with me sinuses. I'll find us a fine place to find you said you've never been in a mine. And then return with a borrowed flat wagon. I'll meet you at the mouth of the mine shaft. And Irish, I strongly advise you don't run off this time. Bye, horsey. You're trespassing. State your business or move along. Intruders! <laughs>
Oh, damn. Just trying to shoot your hat off, I'm sorry. I mean the might of so many of you. Oh, I do love when the murder music kicks in. I'm sorry. I was aiming for your hat. John. You're right in the face. I'm sorry, partner. That was not my intention. It's complicated. Shooter challenge. Sorry. 
I hope your friend's wearing a hat. He's not. Why have all of you people forsaken the Western tradition of headwear? It's a Gatling gun for sure. Government issue. Beautiful weapon. God's own gun. Ain't that the truth? I got us a borrowed flatbed parked down. Don't let go of her. She's a beast. Let's go, John. You and your weird floaty legs. Grab on. Let's go for a ride. Shit.
Let's go! A short wee ride now, and we'll have this executive peacemaker delivered to Old West Dickens. Just make sure it doesn't fall off on the way. Wish they have more set pieces like that.